The kale is a no-no. Thirdly, your girl was up until 12.30 editing that video. I said I'm not keeping my computer overnight to render it. So I'm going to upload it while I'm doing my yoga sesh. And I hope you guys enjoy it. I don't think I usually post. Now I think about it, it's been months since I posted a vlog this late. Editing that vlog took up the time I was supposed to film. Editing that vlog... Now that I think about it, it's been a long time since I posted a vlog a day late. I've been really good. Oh well, happens. Now that I think about it, the time that it took me to edit that vlog, I was supposed to also record two pods. I always want to say film. And an affirmations. Fix my banner. <laughs> and change my display picture on all social platforms. Now that happened. I just edited it. Two of my most recent videos have mistakes in it. One, the video shifted over so there's a black bar. The other one, I'm shifted over, but that's because I can't see the viewfinder. So once it's done, it's done. If I have enough time, I would refilm, but that day I had to go up. <laughs> this right here? Okay. I think I'm doing it right. Isn't it crazy I can't see his feet from here anymore? I'm gonna sit and I'm like, I don't even, I can't even pretend like I have time to sit. My therapy session starts in six minutes. Did I see that right? Either way. Okay. This is cement. What am I doing today? I literally thought I'd wake up with enough time to do my workup, do my pods, have my therapy so that when I come back and edit the pods, put them up and then do the affirmations and then edit the other video, but I haven't done any of that. I'm just gonna upload the video just now. Cause I think she's logging on right now. How does this always happen? I don't know what's been going on with me today. Not today, this week, okay? There were some samples that I got from Sephora and I was so excited to use them to see if it was worth buying the full size. Can't find them anywhere. Can't even remember if I threw them on or not. All over the place. 
And then earlier today, I tossed the smaller version of this in the recycling bin because I'm like, oh, I'm gonna buy a new bottle because the mini literally lasts me a year because I only use it on my eye area. And I don't like having big bottles in my bathroom. I don't know, am I the only one that's weird? I like mini sizes and then I'll have maybe a big backup that I refill. Like I do that with my nail polish remover and a couple other things. Point of the story is, they didn't have the small size, so I bought the big size, which is more value anyway. It just takes up so much space in my small cupboard. Mushrooms, these things you don't get, you guys don't care about. Oh my gosh, guys. My brother was trying to help me with the machine since it's hard to see and we were doing self-checkout. I was zooming into the receipt app and I didn't see this on there, so I think we might have taped it. I think, I'm not sure. I need to look again. I hope we did it. Because shrimps are expensive and I feel so bad. Imagine if they have like a photo of us on the wall for stealing shrimp. I didn't intend to, I swear. Light bulbs, which are so expensive nowadays. I'm so shook by that. This is the best lychee juice and I just finished. Oh wait, was that coconut juice or lychee juice that I finished last night? I think it's both. Actually, let me finish this off, wash the bottle and then refill it. No? Oh, I got two of them. See? No, that's not juice. That's chicken broth. Okay, avocados, they were 170, which is a whole dollar cheaper than Metro down the street. What else did I get in this magic bag? Pesto sauce. I was looking for chow mein, because if you guys watched last week's vlog, you know the chow mein was not it last week, so I'm like, let me try again. No chow mein to be found. And I haven't had these in so long. I was looking for the beef version of them and they were sold out, so good. Also, how is it a dollar 50 cheaper just because it's at a different store? It's the same company of choice. Is this a Canadian thing? Or if you live in Europe or in the States or elsewhere, South America, the Caribbean, any place, do you find when you go to one store, something is like two or three dollars cheaper than another? I feel like that shouldn't be even legal. Super squishy. And I think it's actually leaking juices. Gross. What's with my creepy elevator music though? these bottles so pretty I feel like it just it's giving the maca pot is maca potting should I make an iced or a hot latte because it's cold outside but it's warm in here but if I drink it iced and I feel cold I'm gonna be so annoyed this one and I can put this one in this one Guys, this is not blind girl friendly at all. Oh my goodness. I should not be bending it like Beckham, but where's the hole? It's here, but where's the clamp? Who decided that a screw would be a good idea? I'm like trying to sound. was to make the light like this. I hope I don't have to change it until I move out and aim my light bulbs back. <laughs> now check this. You guys might be like, this girl's such a weirdo. I don't know where else to store the used light bulbs. So I just put in my leggings. <laughs> There's no other light bulb better blow up while I live here. Kale is a no-no, never ever again. Usually it's not that bitter. Wow. Wow. Where does time go? I can't believe it's almost 8 o'clock. I 
feel like I've been working all day and woman's work is never done because once I come out of the shower, I gotta make the banner. At least I did everything I need to do for YouTube today. I did my two pods and my affirmation. So that's out of the way. I'm so happy. Hope you guys are enjoying it if you're listening. Like every vlog has a little story time. So here goes me thinking I have a Sephora gift card. Let me use it during the sale. I wanted to treat myself to the Kaylee Vanilla Cocoa perfume. I've heard so much about the vanilla one, but I figured I could get vanilla at Bath & Body Works. I'm not, no, just no. But cocoa though, if you know me, coconut everything. You've won my heart. It's just everything to me. So I thought that'd be the perfect way to try Kiali scent. Then what, two days ago, this came in the mail and I'm like, hmm, I can't see what it says. So I'm like, the box? Okay. And then I take it out the box and it's the same shape. But again, I'm like, wait, isn't the cap supposed to be a gem? I zoom in, I call up Sephora so quick. Hey, you sent me the wrong thing. They refunded me with no hesitation, told me to keep or discard this. It doesn't smell bad. In fact, when I smelled it, I'm like, oh, this smells good, but I'm not getting vanilla cocoa. <laughs> Clearly it's not vanilla cocoa. So I asked the guy, hey, when's the mini of the Kaoli coming in? Because that's what I ordered. And it went out of stock the day after I ordered it. I don't know, blah, blah, blah. So we ordered the next size up and it came today. See, this is the cap I was expecting. And I also completely forgot that the bottle was gold. This is really pretty. I spritzed this this morning. It really is giving tropical paradise. The only thing is it's light, light, like airy light, like barely there, like, like poof, poof, gone light. And for the price, I don't know guys. I made this rule this year after an incident where I said, I'm never buying anything unless I love it 110%. You gotta value your money. So I might actually send this back, especially if you've seen the Sephora haul. I already got a fragrance. Well, this is from Jeff a year ago. I'm just trying to put it in the thingy, but I have, where is it? I still haven't opened it because I'm trying to savor it. I wanted this scent for over a year. So if anything, I'll just keep that little travel size and call it a day. But I wanted to try something that was light and very summery, you know? It's beautiful, it's a vibe. Anywho, I don't know what we're gonna do tonight. I feel like taking a shower though, that's all I know. If I go out, I'll bring you guys along. If I don't, I'll see you in the morning. How often does this happen? Cause homeboy refunded me real quick. And if you've seen that episode of Orange is the New Black, you know what I'm thinking. Anyway, I go to return something to Sephora yesterday and does the girl next to me not tell the cashier, I didn't order this perfume. So I don't know if they're making mistakes with the same perfume or perfume in general. I mean, life happens to urge human to forgive is divine. But I was laughing and thinking at the same time, these noise cancellations really aren't working because I shouldn't be able to hear that. But anyways, I'll catch you guys later tonight or tomorrow. Jorge. Doing a little late night self care. Figured I'd put on a little mask since we're getting back into that. I'm gonna do a little pedicure. I'm not gonna show you that because that's gross. And I had a good night with Boriana tonight. I'm so happy I tried that dish. I would have never picked it, but she said 10 out of 10 highly recommended. It. it was so delish. Hold on. Let me turn on the light. Not that I look good. Tonight was a good night. I feel like I've been such a bad vlogger because I didn't vlog Sunday. And I also barely vlog today, but sometimes it just be that way. So I hope that your day went well. I hope I do more tomorrow, but I also, I'm supposed to be spending time with family. <laughs> and you know how that goes. If you watch my vlogs before, you know family time is sacred time. So I might show you snippets, B-roll but it might not be that much. So I'll see you guys in the morning.
I have not been here in years. How are you? Good, how are you? He's in the washroom right now, so I'm just trying to say hi real quick. This is so pretty, I just noticed it now. I cleaned up a little bit. I figured I would sit and show you guys, update you, because I feel like I haven't talked to the camera in this vlog. I've been showing you random things and not explaining. I was getting good and then I got bad. I really fell off with this vlog, sorry guys. So went out to lunch today with my uncle. I felt so rushed after yoga and a couple other things I had to do. So I didn't get to tell you guys that's what I was doing. He doesn't really believe in that vlog life. <laughs> so I was just sneaking what I could show you guys. And then we went on a long walk. Three hours later, I'm still stopped. I was supposed to stop off at the supermarket to grab something for tonight's meal. Completely forgot when I got home, I'm like, do I wanna go back out in that? Cause now it's starting to rain. As you can tell, it's so dark and it's not that late. So I thought, you know what? My friend brought food last night. I still have meal prep for the night before that. I could just eat those things, but I wanted to offset. Cause you know, my meal was very decadent for lunch. I kind of wanted to go green and clean tonight. Speaking of, you saw what I ate yesterday, really good. I'm so glad that I took her recommendation. And then she gave me a little bag of PR goodies. First thing is this. She said, everything's black owned business. I can't tell you what it says, sorry guys, but it's a net. And I've seen so many people use these in their nighttime routine, skincare, shower routine, whatever it may be. And they say it's so much better than a loofah. It doesn't really have a smell, but it does feel, it feels more squishy than a loofah. I don't know how to explain it. I told myself, use it as soon as you shower. I've taken two showers since she gave this to me. Keep forgetting it. So I'm going to put it in the shower right now. And then she gave me bonbons, even though I told her, girl, there's still 11 days left of Lent. I can't. I can't. The temptation is so real. Even today at lunch, my uncle's like, mm, this is so good. The sugars are blending so well. He was doing the most trying to tempt me to try out some of his dessert. I said, nope. And it turns out our server was also doing, not Lent, I think she's just doing a sugar cleanse as well. So she's like, how many days have you done? I'm on day seven, it's hard. I said, day 30. She's like, oh, it's possible then. These candles, they're so pretty on the top and they smell divine. I can't tell you what the labels say, but just know they're heavenly. I'm Shea Moisture product. She said she's gonna send me a whole media kit. So I'll do an unboxing for you when that arrives, probably next week though. But anywho, I'm gonna do some laundry because if you saw the last time I did it in whatever vlog it was, and the bag bus opened on me and it was a whole struggle to get my clothes down to the laundry room. Oh, I'm not looking forward to this. I was at Yorkdale yesterday didn't even get anything. I went through the whole mall. I wanted to use a gift card and then I couldn't because they were sold out of my size. And only today did I realize I should have gone to one of those home stores and looked for a laundry bag or a basket or a bin or something. But oh well, it wasn't meant to be. Morning loves, you know those days when you're just not, you're just not here for it? It's one of them days. <laughs> Oh my gosh, again. Never pick the one from the front. Oh, they weren't kidding. There's no zucchini. Nothing here either. Crazy. Crazy. I've never seen a supermarket that empty it was desolate i did get a little bit of things or got a few things luckily for me there's multiple grocery stores in the same neighborhood so i was able to get some cashew milk and oat milk since i got to alternate there goes the receipt Le resu, some olive bread too loaf diol my french is so trash oh my gosh listening to the podcast daily clearly is not helping clearly of course, Lebanon. 
What else is in here? I feel like it's a magic trick. How much can fit in this Lululemon bag? And then, I don't know what yogurt is in French. And I don't even know if this flavor is good, but they sold out of coconut. I haven't seen coconut on the shelf for almost a month now. Long Yon, last week's vlog, I got dairy kefir and I wanted non-dairy kefir. And they're the same price, so I might as well get the non-dairy one, right? I wanna see if it's gonna be quiet enough to film. I don't want to set up and do everything, put my face on and then like you heard this morning. So I'm going to eat, make a... Whoop. Paranoia is also marking out the barcode in case someone scans it. Wait, there's more? No way. Chilling. And the rain stopped too. So peaceful. I'm in such a weird mood. I don't know what it is. I think I might be a little ticked off that someone really did teeth the Tom Ford. How could they tell what it was? It doesn't say it on the Sephora box. It's not even for me. I don't like Tom Ford fragrances. I think they're overrated if you ask me. But uh, yeah, I'm very annoyed. Anyways, no point staying in this state. I'm going to edit for a little bit. And I'll check in with you guys, honestly, probably tomorrow. Because the mood I'm in, I'm just going to zone in, get this done, and up ASAP Rocky. Don't let me just let up. I want to give you better. Maybe it's whatever. Somebody gotta step up, girl, man. Somebody saw him let it go. Damn if we let him catch up. See. Why did that biotin pill taste like that? That's so gross. Anyway, morning, guys. <laughs> Trying this again. Spinach, kale, avocado. What else did I throw in here? Oat milk, mango, pineapple. Yeah, it should be good. Yesterday's was not good. I did matcha with yogurt, which usually would be good, but I think the kale spinach ratio was a no-no moment of truth no it's good you can't go wrong i thought that the citrusness and acidity from the pineapple would throw off the oat milk it's not bad it's not bad at all because usually when i do mango pineapple i'll do coconut water instead of a milk and nut milk oat milk milk alternative whatever it's called anyway on the roster today, let me turn that off so you can actually hear me because I'm fighting against this rumbling refrigerator. I'm going to finish editing the video. I was up until 12 last night. I'm like, don't do it. You know, sometimes I like to push it past one. I'm supposed to be in bed by 11. That didn't happen. And then I have a couple things to do that would bore you. And then I may see a couple friends tonight. So if I do, I'll bring you guys along. No shift. Look, he's my mom for the night. But those are the only two things, right? Yes. <laughs> it's not beef for days. That's not how you it's say it. For days. I don't know how they say it. Five star me service, me sure. Big jump. Why? Yeah. Are you trying to fat me up? Butter chicken, but I think it might. How did you grow so much hair in such a short time? <laughs> it's called weave. For like, me, it's like. Um, I just have it. Um, just admit it. it. I know. Once you get past know. that point, you get better. I know. Look at your <laughs> face. She's like, what's happening? Just a little after midnight. I'm back home. That was so much fun. I haven't seen my friends in a minute. It was good catching up with them. Always good times. But now it's time for me to get some shut-eye. So thanks as always for spending another week with me. If you enjoyed, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe. And until tomorrow, next week for you, stay safe, stay sane, stay blessed. Love you later.